Trent just made a discovery. And it's almost made us mad. It's an earthworm. A worm. A worm. A magnet. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? This makes us mad because nobody's told us this before. <laughs> Does that mean the the worm has can you can it hang from the magnet? I haven't tried. Is it just one part of his body? I don't know. Or her body? What the heck, man? Oh. It felt that. Oh, look what it just did. What'd it do? It broke part of his body. The magnet did? Look at that. Do you think there's a piece of metal inside the worm? Is it just in that location? I don't know. I think so. Uh, oh, the worm shocked me. Okay, worm. You think there's a little, maybe there's like a little, sh was this on the ground? Yeah, there's more of them out there. It's just the one location. So this worm has a piece of metal in it. We can go look and find some more. More worms. All right. Okay, we have another. There's two worms. Shut up. What the heck, man? <laughs> this makes me angry because I don't understand it. Look at that. Is there something in the digestive system of... I have to, I have to pick up a worm with do, a magnet. Do it. There's another worm. What, what are you doing? Oh, look at that. You see it? <gasps> oh, what's happening, dude? <laughs> what's happening? <laughs> oh, man. What's going on, dude? Why don't I know... That's a dead worm. Oh. I think they're pooping out. Is the soil... Does the soil have too much... It's not a dead worm. Does the soil have so much iron in it? Let's go find a... Uh... <sighs> Get that one. <laughs> Okay, come on, worm. We ain't going. We're not gonna fish with you. Okay, so here, go ahead, try. So, is it just worms in proximity to the shop? I don't know. That's not a magnetic worm. <laughs> That's a non-ferrous worm. <laughs> it's a brand new sentence right there. Uh, it's a, it's a non-ferrous worm. I cannot believe this is what we're doing right now. This is the right thing to be doing, is <laughs> picking up worms with magnets. Okay, conclusion so, is... I have a theory. What's your theory? The blanket was sitting on the driveway. Yeah? And it has been there for a day, two days. Yeah? With a bunch of rainfall. And there's a bunch of iron dust all over the, the ground. And they've been eating it? I wonder if they've been eating it. Okay, we've got a pile of steel here. All right. I want there to be a worm under this. I struck out, there's no worms. This isn't right. It's not a worm in here. We are worm poor. <gasps> there's a worm. He's a tiny, he's a tiny worm. No, no, no. These worms, these are the ferris worms. <laughs> okay, so. All right, so all this, yeah, you see all this? This is all iron from when we were grinding. That's what's going on. There's iron in the worm's digestive system. That's what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, we've poisoned the worms. 
humanity. <laughs> that, was, <laughs> that just jumped up on the magnet. Oh, golly. So we ground iron or steel in these locations, and that's all rust. And we've created... I feel bad. I feel like we've done something wrong, man. Look at that. That is insane. But the Earth's crust has a lot of iron in it. So does that mean that there could be, like, locally, you could measure... The ferocity of the soil based on how worms. magnetic worms are. <laughs> you have the magnet in a paint cap, and so you just run it like that, and that's how you picked up stuff. Mm -hmm. Then you pull that out, and then all your nails are right there. Yep. <laughs> Except I did it wrong. You do it over the garbage can, they fall out. So you fall out. open up here. Do that, and then you pull the magnet out, and then the nails fall out. And that's, <laughs> you picked up a worm on accident? <laughs> <laughs> so that's how we made the great discovery that's how that's how things happen <laughs> okay so i just recorded a video about worms and i love it <laughs> i love that video it's so simple the like the mystery and the magic of like trying to figure out this worm problem i love that and I, that's like, that's where I like to operate as a person. I just want to explore the world using science and I want it to be fun. And that's what I'm gonna do. And so here's my play. I want to be able to show you the videos when I make them. And I don't want any algorithm in between you or I. So here's what I would propose. Please consider going to smartereveryday.com and I'm gonna, I've got an email list there. I've already made it, but I'm, this is the first time I've announced it. So if you consider going to smartereveryday.com, clicking on the email list, I will literally email you when I upload a video and I will keep you up to date on all the latest worm news in Alabama. <laughs> I mean, you know what I'm trying to say. I want, to explore the world in a curious way, and I wanna show you what I'm learning, because that's what Smarter Every Day is for me. So, thank you also to the patrons. I should have sent you a baseball if you're a patron. If not, I'm still sending baseballs. So if you'd like to be a patron at smartereveryday.com, no, patreon.com slash smartereveryday, I'll send you a baseball, and like, thank you for pitching in and making this happen. But I realize that not everybody is willing to pitch in financially to support a channel like this. So. That's the purpose of the email list. If you want to go back to Internet 1.0 with me, and let's just do this the old school way, I will email you when I make a video, and there will be no algorithms in between you or I, and we're going to do this brute force, and it's going to be awesome. So if you're in, thank you. I will leave a link down in the description of this video. Go right to the email list and verify your email address, and feel free to unsubscribe anytime. But anyway, Internet 1.0, me and you, just going to explore the world using science and have fun. I am grateful for you. Thank you for considering support via Patreon. And also thank you for considering signing up for the email list. I'm Destin. You get smarter every day. Have a good one. Bye.